Creation versus consumption is the distinction between childhood and adulthood. It seems to me that most people want to experience the same stuff. They want to travel the world or visit beautiful places or sip from that juicy liquid in a crystal clear glass sitting on the beach. They want to go hiking and festivals and visit museums and go out with your friends and ingest variations of the same dish. But in order to get to do these things, you need supplies, you need someone to build the things you require, the things you are going to consume. The food you eat on the streets, someone has to cook it. Someone needs to write the books you ingest while drinking a glass of red wine after you just came home from work. You need to be entertained, but with more of us spending our time consuming, there are less and less people creating. The movies we watch have become more and more predictable, that's because we've seen variations before. The social media content we consume can easily be placed in categories because this is how individuals work. More concerned with staying in our pod, ingesting what others created instead of pursuing our own weird interests. We are wired to stay on the path of least resistance. Creating things requires isolation, time, patience. The reason why this worked out as a child is because we had all of this. We were not bombarded and we did not have to worry. We just did things. Now society views those who stay in isolation creating stuff as weirdos. But these same weirdos probably build the app you need to order your food or book a flight or send a meme to your significant other, thus upgrading your cleverness. And people are more concerned with selling ideas and concepts, which is kind of what I'm doing right now. And we hope that someone can come in and take that idea and make it reality. Again, we are adding so much stuff on our plate, but we are all eating on the same restaurant. We want to do the same stuff. While the creator's mindset might still be there somewhere, we are using it to hone new interests and hobbies we absorb from other people. And that's because it's easy and it gives you the feeling of progress. Hipsters interested in philosophy now learn how to cook tacos and grow exotic plants and brew their own beer. We play games in virtual reality to have a sense of progress. And then we have kids and more and more people start to see kids as vanity projects as they pour all of their energy into them. And they want them to succeed and go through the system and have stability because no one wants to see their child hopping trains. Your kid becomes you and you forget about yourself. It is easy and you have an excuse that society thinks is noble for generations. But you did create something, right? You brought a new being into the world, but so have many before you. <laughs>